how to maintain income and expense with profit and loss in excel for personal and office use in this video you will learn about it i am farhan you are watching digi mastery channel let's start First we design layout of income and expense dashboard like this. After layout design Select this cell and write serial number, date, source of income, amount and select all four headings and press Ctrl C on your keyboard, copy that and left one cell and click on this cell and Ctrl V and replace that cell value to expense and adjust all the columns width like this now select two rows with heading and press ctrl t my table has header check this box and press ok now this range convert to table format as you can see design tab here uncheck the banded row box and change table style if you want like this now select opposite two rows and columns like this and press ctrl t my table has header check this box and press ok and also uncheck banded row box from here and change heading color like this Now you see our format is ready. Now we insert shapes here for income, expense, profit and loss. Before we insert shape, go to insert tab and go to shape and select the rectangle shape and draw here. Fill color white and outline color select no outline. This is our first shape. Copy this shape, hold control button on your keyboard and with mouse click here and drag it like this. Align all this shape like this. Now here we insert icons of income, expense, profit and loss like this. Now adjust all the icon in these rectangle shapes one by one like this Now after adjust all the shapes, again we select this rectangle shape 
and draw here and write here total income and write here total income like this now select text and fill icon color in text and select this shape and go to format tab and in shape fill we select no fill and in outline option we select no outline now make three copy of this hold control and click and drag like this and adjust this all shape now change name here total expense here total profit and here total loss Now our design is ready. For calculation, create new sheet and type here income expense profit loss for income select this cell right here is equal to sign sum bracket start go to main sheet and select this range of cell like this now here this cell show zero because there is no entry same process repeat with expense right is equal to sign sum bracket start go to main sheet and select this range of cells and press enter now you see zero here also now quickly we enter some data like this Now you can see here our total income and here our total expense. Now for profit select this, select this cell, write as equal to sign, if bracket start, if income this cell is greater than this expense cell comma then income cell minus expense cell comma zero bracket close and press enter you can see profit in loss we select this cell and write is equal to sign if bracket start income cell is less than from expense cell comma expense cell minus income cell value comma zero bracket close press enter now you can see loss is zero now here we add new entry purchase amount and that is expense now you see loss this cell 
Now we need to show these values in dashboard. Now for showing these all calculated values in dashboard, first we go to insert tab, select this shape and draw here. Click on this shape and in formula bar we write is equal to sign go to calculation sheet select this income cell and press enter now you can see total income now format it like this and adjust it under total income Now back to our calculation sheet and select all these cells. Go to format cell and select number group. Now put decimal to zero and click on this 1000 separator box. Press OK. Now you see this type of values that is also show here in dashboard now make three copy of this shape hold control click and drag and adjust it all shape like this now click on expense shape here now we only change the cell address like this for total expense show in dashboard and same process repeat to profit and loss cell values to show in dashboard. Adjust and format all values like this. Now press Ctrl plus F1 to hide the ribbon. Now if we want that formula bar is not show. Go to view tab and uncheck this box. Now you see all sheet scroll down here. Now here we select this row under the heading and go to view tab and select free span you can see our work is done all above rows of heading freeze now this data is still more all the above rows of headings freeze now you can see dashboard all the time for heading remove go here in view tab and uncheck this now make some entries this is basic training file if you want this file please subscribe like and in comment give me your email address I will send you this file for practice. I hope you will enjoy this video. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video.